Police say Middle Tennessee is a drug trafficking hotspot because of its geographical location. Several recent busts spotlighting law enforcement's efforts to keep illicit drugs off our streets. News 2's Stephanie Langston talked with Metro Police about some of the trends they're now seeing. Steph. Well, Haley, once drugs make it into the hands of Metro Police, they say it can be difficult to pinpoint exactly where they originated from, saying sometimes it's across the southern border, but with a number of interstates crossing through the mid-state, Middle Tennessee is a central hub when it comes to drug trafficking making it easy for drugs to be brought in or continue on to the final destination. Just by geographical happenstance, it becomes an easy hub for drugs to come in, be dispersed locally, or continue on to whatever, you know, in route it's looking to go, whether that's the east coast, south of here, further on into the northeast. Um, it's just geographically, it's, it's kind of a perfect storm of our interstate system and our proximity to other in locations for the drugs that are being trafficked. Now, Lieutenant Matthew Bogeski says they are seeing fentanyl in the majority of street level drugs with statistics showing it was found in more than 75 percent of our overdose deaths in 2022 and 2023. Now, just last week, Metro Police worked with a number of agencies on a massive drug bust that resulted in 120,000 fentanyl pills being seized. Uh, Lieutenant Bogeski also points out that efforts like that save lives as does their outreach to educate people on the dangers of fentanyl. Haley.